Hey guys, welcome to the 3D Find. My name is Saro and today we are going to talk about how 3D printing is helping to fight the new COVID-19 virus. Now, with the WHO declaring the COVID-19 aka coronavirus as a global pandemic, the medical personnel are doing all they can to solve this problem. Originating in the Wuhan city of China, it has now spread to multiple countries and number of cases are on the rise. With such a large number of cases, there is a shortage of medical supplies. At the same time, along with the threat of developing a coronavirus, the threat of collapsing global economy is growing exponentially. Stock exchanges around the world are drowning, freight and logistics are barely falling, and trading companies are sinking into melancholy, inevitably leading to despair. Hundreds of design engineers from across the world have offered to donate their 3D printing skills and equipment to help produce vital hospital supplies amid the evolving coronavirus pandemic. One of the biggest immediate problems that coronavirus is causing is the massive number of people who require intensive care and oxygenation in order to live through the infection long enough for their antibodies to fight it. This means the only way to save their lives at this point beyond prevention is to have as many working reanimation machines as possible and when they break down, maybe 3D printing can help. The hospital in Russia, near one of the hardest hit regions for coronavirus infections, urgently needed pairs for an intensive care device and their supplies could not provide them in a short time. Running out of wells would have them dramatic and some people might have lost their lives. So they asked if it was possible to 3D print them. A company in the area, IC Nova, responded to this call for help, which brought a 3D printer directly to the hospital and just a few hours redesigned and then produced the missing piece. On the evening of Saturday, 14 March 2020, the next day, it was reported that the system works. By 14, 10 patients are accompanied in breathing by a machine that uses a 3D printed valve. Just as the above case, you saw there are many other ways 3D printing can contribute to limiting and possibly stopping the coronavirus. As the virus inevitably continues to spread worldwide and break supplies chain, 3D printers through people's ingenuity and design abilities can definitely lend a helping hand. Many medical supplies can be printed like equipment parts or well, or protective gear, or mask, or anything you will need and can't get from your usual supplier. In the description, there is a full list of printables that are currently being printed. Well, this is all about 3D printed related news. Here are some steps you can take care to protect yourself and others from this pandemic. Clean hands frequently with alcohol-based hand rub, soap or water. Cover nose and mouth when coughing or sneezing with a tissue or fixed elbow. Avoid close contact with anyone who has symptoms of cold or flu. Stay safe. Thank you.